Well, hello and welcome back to some more drawings from Kieran Siemens. We're going to have some fun today. And I see, I seem to have lost my shoes. What have I? How can a man lose his? How can a man lose his shoes? I'm sure I was wearing them a minute ago. Anyway, hey, let's do a drawing. <laughs> Don't worry about my shoes. <laughs> Well, hello and welcome back. I'm terribly sorry about that weird intro. Um, I was going to tell you about this little dog that I saw in the park, and I come, I got completely sidetracked. Sorry about that. Right. Anyway, I saw this lovely little dog in the park, and I got to, got to try and get a drawing of him of some sort. He was this little dog, and he only had one eye. One eye. I was like, why has a dog only got one eye? And, um, so we, uh, I don't know. He was such a cute little fluffy little creature. And, um, and I wanted to give him a drawing. He just seemed so, so cute and so kind of lovable. And, and it, but he only had one eye. I was thinking, I, th I think he was called Echo, I think. I was like, I would have called him Eyeball. <laughs> What's the name of your dog? Eyeball. <laughs> so, that's the beginning of today's drawing. A big blob. A big blob of craziness. Let's get in there. And the funny thing was that because he only had one, one eye, it almost kind of looked like he was kind of pulling... Because this eye was closed, he was pulling his mouth up and he had this gorgeous little expression which I'm going to try and attempt to draw for you today. Does that help? How are you today? Are you feeling good? Fantastic. I love when, they, when you see... Um, owners and their dogs in the park and it's always like little stories about oh where did you get your dog and people have got some amazing stories and um yeah so this little dog was called echo <laughs> my 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 childish brain was already already going eyeball i'm gonna call you eyeball if you were my dog i would have called you eyeball so it would really embarrass people as they said, oh, what's the name of your dog? Eyeball. <laughs> oh, my wicked streak, I guess. And, um, and he was such an odd little dog. But to be honest, like the owner was kind of like a little bit out there as well, you know. It was like, it was a really nutty little combination. I hope the person who owns that dog now is not going to see this drawing. It would be really embarrassing, wouldn't it? Hey, you laughing at my dog? No, I wasn't laughing at your dog. I'm just... It's just sometimes my... My childish mind kind of takes over sometimes, you know? You kind of see somebody who's talking about something and you... Your mind starts to kind of playing tricks on you and you start imagining them doing this and doing that. And, and then when you kind of come back to reality you kind of realize that you haven't listened to a word they've been saying and you find yourself going right yeah yeah so I'm getting them a nice big gooey eye there I'm gonna try and get a big kind of a big kind of muddy ring around his eyes and it really makes that eye stand out more I'm going to have to 
kind of put a little kind of cross in there or something for for his missing eye. And, uh, that's his other little eyebrow there. But he was such a cute little dog, really. In fact, the, the odd thing about it is he looks like another dog that comes to the park. But he has both eyes. It was kind of like a very kind of strange kind of combination of looking at him. He's got two eyes. Looking at him, he's got one eye. So I love to take Mr. Miro to the park. It's a great relaxation for the mind. And, you know, it's, it's great for him also. He gets out to see all these little buddies. And they can have their insane little run around. I'm just trying to get some shading in there around. Try and darken up around this eye. Just to kind of give him that kind of expression a little bit more. Dirty it up around there. Oh, it looks kind of nice. <laughs> Mr. Mir is now sniffing my feet because he's probably also thinking, where's your shoes gone? I have no idea what I've done with my shoes. Oh, I've, I've, um, I spent this, this this morning. I've spent it putting up some some greetings cards. I know that people have been asking about prints and um, stuff like that for the shop. Um, I did put up some greetings cards. I would really like uh, it, not so much um, asking you to buy, but I'm asking you to have a look and give me some feedback on them. What more kind of things would you like to see? Because you guys are kind of the ones that are there every day of the week and you kind of see my drawings and you kind of know what is there so you'll probably be the best people to kind of tell me what i should kind of put in there a little bit you know so i'd really appreciate your um feedback on that give me some uh some ideas of what you would like to see there let's give me that brush back He had these kind of like odd kind of like little kind of teddy bear earrings. Not teddy bear earrings, teddy bear ears, sorry. And I'm trying to get these kind of little Yeah, I'd really love some feedback from people just to kind of tell me what 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 was interesting, what what your you like to see in shops, especially kind of like art shops, because it's like you know I like to draw in my style, and I, so uh, I'm I'm kind of curious. Would you know? Should I do kind of like birthday cards and Christmas cards and Halloween cards and you know, is that the kind of thing you guys are into? Is it something that you should see on a shop? Or is it just not? I'm kind of curious, you know. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have to call him eyeball now, aren't I? That's his little name tag. And I am indeed going to call him. <laughs> Eyeball the dog. <laughs> I think it's a cool name. I would definitely call, if it was my dog, I'd definitely be calling him Eyeball. <laughs> I love that little expression he's got there. Yeah, what was I talking about? I was talking about the shop, wasn't I? Yeah. Um, yeah, there's, there's, um, I'd love, to see, I'd love to hear what people think of it. Originally, the shop was, was supposed to be for prints, you know. You can do, like, art prints and stuff like that, but. Uh, I guess it wasn't so popular with prints. I don't. I thought the prints would have been a great thing, but I don't know. Were they too expensive, or were they? See, you have to do it through all these companies. So <laughs> and his little tail. <laughs> oh, lovely, 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 lovely. It's got such, such feeling about this character. I love it. It is a, it's such a lovely feeling when you when you when you kind of just drawing and the and the characters just come up to see you you know they come up out of the paper and and it's so beautiful it's it, it really is such an exciting thing for me it's like the characters just come up they just kind of show themselves Cute. Look at his little paw in there. And the crazy thing is, he looks just like my drawing. <laughs> how, can I, how can a dog be that cute, really? Even with one eye, he's so cute. It was just like, you just wanted to scoop him up and take him home, you know, sit and watch TV with him. Lovely. <laughs> what a sweet little beastie. Lovely, lovely, lovely. This is Eyeball. I'm going to call him Eyeball. I'm not going to call him Echo. I'm going to call him Eyeball. That's his new name from now on. So in the comments, if you talk about him, you have to call him Eyeball or Dog. 
<laughs> it's actually quite a sad story to to be a little bit serious for a moment. It's it was actually um it kind of got an infection and um, that's what happened. It wasn't like it wasn't like he kind of got attacked by a grizzly bear or something. Oh, I'll tell you what, if I was that dog, I wouldn't be going around telling people, ah, like, oh, yeah, I lost my eye because of an infection. I'd be saying it was a grizzly bear or something. I definitely would. I would not be going around the other dog saying, oh, what happened to your eye? No. Got sick. I would be saying, man, let me tell you the story of the night I got caught by a grizzly bear. Oh, man, put the kettle on. It's going to be a wild story, man. That's what I would be doing. I wouldn't be. I'd be lying through my teeth. I would be. <laughs> so if I ever lose my eye and I tell you the story about me and a grizzly bear, I guess I've kind of given the game away, haven't I? Lovely. What a gorgeous, gorgeous little dog. Come on, that is gorgeous, isn't he? Wouldn't you take him home? You definitely would take him home. He'd be chewing away on you, sharing the pizza with you or something like that for sure. Oh, he's lovely. <laughs> I forgot to check my camera. Yes, I'm okay. What a lovely little creature. That is a lovely drawing. Comments, please. I love to hear from you. Send me a comment. Tell me what you think. What do you feel? What are you thinking about? How was your day? Anything. Let's just, let's just stay in touch, man. That's me. Decorative patches to make him look special, to make him look original. All my drawings are original, all my drawings are different. There's nothing in my repertoire that looks like anybody else's drawings, that is for sure. That is so cute. I'm so happy. I didn't, I was thinking, was it, was it horrible of me to do this drawing? You know, it's like poor little doggy and everything. But no way, man. I'm so happy that I've done this drawing. That is just like the cutest little dog. It is just absolutely gorgeous. Now I've got, I'm just running out of ink. I'm just trying to see if I've got enough ink in there to, to frame it up. Boom. Let's do a nice thin frame. Get in there and use up this last bit of ink. Wow, beautiful. That is gorgeous. Even if I say so myself. <laughs> Aren't I terrible? That is a beautiful, beautiful dog. If there was a dog show, he would definitely, definitely be the winner. 
That is so gorgeous. <laughs> yes! Forgot, forgot to do his little claws on his hand and he's I, I, I do like his little name tag with eyeball written on it that's so cute man that's lovely I'm really pleased with that one today that is such a lovely drawing Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm very happy. So, that is Eyeball the dog. <laughs> and he, he kind of looks happy. He looks happy and he's full of life. And he's like, okay, I've got one eye, but I'm going to have some fun, man. And that is him. And he is beautiful. What a cool drawing. I'm so pleased I got to share that with you today. So, please, send me a comment. What do you think of Eyeball the dog? Do you think he's... The most gorgeous dog on the earth. Do you think he's going to have an incredible day? Or do you think all the girls are going to be thinking he's winking at them? <laughs> maybe. Maybe. Thank you very much for coming today. Thank you very much for being here. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. I love to see from you. I love to see you every single day. I'm always here during something. So have a fantastic day. And I will see you again tomorrow. Be there or be square. <laughs>